In this video we'll take a look at SharePoint Enterprise Search functionality and we'll have a look at it from the point of view of an end user uh, performing searches and viewing the results. We won't be looking at the behind the scenes setup and configuration of Enterprise Search, that can be quite an involved topic, but today we're really interested in what the end user will experience when they're using Search on a day to day basis. So we're here in a very simple sample uh, SharePoint site and over on the left hand side we can see a navigation bar and we have a search option so if we click on the search page we see a very basic almost entirely blank page as, as, as loaded with just a search box in the middle you have a lot of scope to customize this this search page provide various uh, options and filters on here but for the purposes of the example we've kept it very very simple here we also have the ability on any page in the uh, uh, in the site to embed a search box for example over here in the top right hand corner functionality is exactly the same regardless of where we we perform this search from so to use the enterprise search functionality to to run a search all we have to do is enter your search terms into this box, into the search box, exactly as if you were using Google or, or any other uh, uh, web search engine. Hit enter or click the search button and we'll be taken to the search results page. And on the search results page we can see, as you'd expect, all of the uh, documents, web pages, emails, videos, whatever it is that, that, that your enterprise search is indexing and allowing you to search on if it matches your uh, terms then then it will be uh, it will be returned here in the search results page so we can see we've got a web page here and if we we hover over the uh, uh, the, the, the result in the web uh, in this in the search page we'll get a preview of the document and obviously highlights of where those matching terms have been found and from that preview we could open that web page we could click to follow it and monitor any changes to that web page or we could send it on to uh, uh, to, to another uh, person by email now if that was a document as we have below we can see uh, we have a preview of the document and we have the option permissions uh, 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 allowing to edit the document again follow send it on to another recipient or view the library that this documents part of again if we had emails in this um, uh, in, in these results we would also be able to preview and then and then click through to view the emails in their original form whether that was in uh, exchange or whether that was in in CRM wherever those emails were being stored few other options we have within the search results page we can further filter our results so we can choose to only view for example web pages and we can see a list here of all of the results that now meet that criteria okay so again we can view our web pages we can view additional details for each of those results and we have all of those actions there available to us. We could also filter on the author of the documents or pages which we can simply do by clicking on our filters on the left hand side and we can drill down to find exactly the results that we're interested in by applying these filters of author, of, 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 of document type, of the date these were uh, modified last if, if appropriate and we can we can continually refine our search results by uh, by choosing these filters the filters uh, are configurable so again they could be set up uh, uh, to, 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 to match certain uh, uh, requirements that you uh, you have um, so nice and flexible in that regard so hopefully that's been useful and informative and an and a interesting insight into using SharePoint search. It's also worth mentioning that the search pages we've seen it here can be embedded or linked from for example uh, the CRM implementation so rather than uh, users viewing the search capability as an entirely separate site that can be embedded and, and accessed from within CRM 
to to keep all of your functionality uh, nice and, 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 and close together.